One of the key pieces of research that's come from Precision Planting's PTI farm is the importance of downforce. Jason Lee and I are gonna discuss why that's so important to have on your planter. Welcome back to another planter technology segment. We're gonna be talking about how to achieve a better furrow. One of the most important things a planter does is create a furrow that the seeds can easily or cleanly drop to the bottom of so that you're always planting at your set depth into moisture. And one of the technologies that helps you achieve that is a downforce system, which is applying downforce to the row unit so that your opener discs are always at the depth you set. I guess, Jason, why is it really important that we always are planting at the proper depth? Well, there's a lot of reasons. And, you know, in one of our other episodes, we talked about the importance of spacing those seeds out correctly and, and uniformly, right? The other side of that story, though, is making sure that all of those plants come up out of the ground at about the same time, uh, because if they do, they'll develop throughout the season at the same time, and we'll really get that nice, consistent ear size as well per plant. And there's a lot of things that can impact that emergence timing uniformity, right? And, and one of the things that we found in our past research is the importance of planting depth and getting those seeds down into moisture so that they always imbibe water at about the same rate. So that way they germinate and they sprout at the same rate, right? Well, that sounds easy, right? And, and there's a lot of reasons why our planter may not always be planting at that right depth, right? I mean, soil type changes, uh, compaction zones across the field change, moisture levels, topography, you know, even it, how fast my planter is moving across that field, I can get a lot of bounce right on my planter. And so maybe my row units aren't always staying engaged into the ground to maintain that consistent planting depth. And so that's really, you know, why we have Delta Force on our planters is to make sure that we're always maintaining that consistent planting depth and that I can make those seamless adjustments so that I always am. The other thing though we can't do is over compact that furrow by applying too much pressure on our gauge wheels, right? Especially if I'm planting when it's a little bit too wet or if I'm in a soil type that is really prone to compaction. So it's really that striking that balance of making sure I have enough pressure to always maintain consistent planting depth so that I'm not over applying to where I run the risk of uh, compacting the furrow and then I might get some sidewall compaction. So I guess Forrest, with all that in mind, you know, talk to us a little bit about Delta Force, that technology and how that can help a grower achieve that uniform emergence like we're looking for. Well, thanks Jason. So as you mentioned <clears throat> earlier, Massey Ferguson planters are equipped with Precision Planting's Delta Force, which is an hydraulic downforce and lift force. So you have to be able to automatically adjust to that as you go across the field. You know, historically, right, planters had springs or airbags, which typically applied more of a constant force. Yes, you could adjust those, but not row by row and not easily or quickly. And so Delta Force allows, again, like our meters, to have row by row control as each row is experiencing different uh, conditions. And so there's a load pin in each row. And so it continually, it's constantly changing, lifting or applying more force, depending on what's needed to truly uh, get that seed to the proper depth and make sure that your, compact, your, your furrow are not overly compact or under compact for the conditions you're planting in. 